can't think of any video ideas. Call Lester. I'm in the bath. What do you need? Hey, can you come down here real quick? You can't think of any video ideas. I've done, like, done so much stuff, I don't know what else to do. All right, Kim, you're doing it all wrong. As a video creator, videos will come to you. Okay. No, you don't understand, do you? Here, no. come on, come with me, let's go. Sure, yeah, we do this. <laughs> all right, all aboard. Yeah, creating videos is a struggle for everybody, but you really gotta be alert to like new things always on the lookout for anything out of the ordinary and when you find those moments video it uh-oh let me let the bus by <laughs> where are you guys headed i can't find any video ideas oh you're looking for video ideas too that's what we're doing all right good luck with y'all hey alfie Oh, they're here. Oh, hello. Hey. Just ignore us. Come on in, Kim. Um, so what you sometimes do is just walk around and look. See if you notice anything out of the ordinary here. Okay. As you just look around. I see these kids are watching the news. That's exactly what I was noticing too. Here you have two young people. Now these guys are in their early 20s and they're sitting here watching the news. Who does that? Nope. Come on, let's keep looking around. Three year olds watching the news. Yeah. How oh, weird. Morning, folks. Lester and Jamie here. I, we're sitting here having our coffee, and Jamie reminded me that last night I woke up in the middle of the night laughing. Yes. Uh, and I woke her up. I didn't wake up. She woke me up saying yes. I was laughing. I wanted to join in on the fun. I wanted to know what was so funny. I was having a dream, and it was the dumbest dream. And <laughs> I told her about it, and I said, don't let, I don't want to forget this, but I want to talk about it. And so I remember that I was Kim, Sister Kim, you all know Sister Kim, was having a struggle trying to create a video. She could not think of any good video ideas. And I was trying to give her some video ideas. And so I said, let's walk over to Brienne and Laramie's and see what they're doing. You know, Brie. <laughs> so I don't know why, but Kim and I didn't knock. We just walked over and we opened the door. And Brie and Laramie were sitting there and they both had a tube of deodorant in their mouth. All right, so we're going to do a sort of a reenactment of what I dreamed. <laughs> Ready? I feel like I'm being punked here that you didn't No, 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 no. I woke up. This this is what I was dreaming about when I was laughing. And the, they're, I don't know why, but Brie and Laramie was trying to use deodorant and use their, in their mouth. And they were trying to put it under their arms. I don't know why I dreamt that. I don't know where that came like, from. That's the weirdest of weird. I know, okay? I don't know. So Jamie and I are going to leave the caps on. Uh, she has hers. I have mine. Look and at the bottom of mine. Mine has like an extra like thing. Now, how am I supposed to fit that in my mouth? Jamie, fit it in your mouth. <laughs> mm -hmm. mm -hmm. <laughs> Do it. <laughs> Is it on? <laughs> Is it on? <laughs> okay, I didn't want it on. Uh-uh, I'm kidding. Mm. Okay, you can probably take that out now. Oh, hello. Hey. Just ignore us. Come on in, Kim. Um, so what you sometimes do is just walk around and look, and you see if anything like stands out in the ordinary. The dumbest thing we've ever done. Yeah. And that, that's the kind of stuff that I, that, that's the kind of stuff that goes on in his head of mine. 
That's the kind of stuff that goes on in this head of mine. You know all those moments like, like where I'm always like, what are you thinking about? Is it this? Is this where your mind goes to? Like, So Jamie and I were talking about this dream. And then it reminded me of a dream that I had not too long ago that I did not tell her about. Oh but it was very similar in weirdness. And now there's no way to reenact that one. But I dreamt that we had gone to Sister Kim's house and she was hosting a Sunday dinner. Except instead of normally, I think it's Brienne. My hand, I got the shakes today. Here, hold it. No, 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 no. No, you'll put me at a bad angle, Jamie. <laughs> you put me at a bad angle. I'm sorry. Normally, um, I think that Brienne is the one that likes to video the Sunday dinners. Yeah. And I've always thought it was a little bit awkward having, you know, everyone at, at dinner and having someone with a camera just kind of like looking around. But in this particular Sunday dinner, I dreamt that everybody had a camera. <laughs> everybody had a camera. There were everyone at that table had cameras and they were all making this, their own versions of a Sunday dinner. And I remember I felt so awkward sitting there and everyone had cameras Everywhere there were just cameras, cameras, cameras. I would be scared everywhere. to take a bite because I feel like that I'm always like like making the strangest face when I'm eating and somebody gets out a camera anyway. So I would just be sitting there like waiting. And it would probably take forever. Think about that. All the different perspectives and stuff of like like getting ready and then I guess I guess like <laughs> who's looking yeah, at who now, and the beauty of being the video creator or the one holding the camera is that you kinda are in control of what people see. And what they don't see, especially what they don't see. <laughs> it's a lot about what they don't see. And it's so true. every angle, everything that you do is important. And so you have control of that. However, when someone else is videoing, you have no control of that. Oh. Which is scary when you, when you know that you're going to be put out there to the world and you're like, what did they catch me doing? What did I, what, I know. what gesture did I make or what? Oh, I got the shakes. I am so sorry, y'all. Um, you're only, at, you're only on one cup of coffee, too. I am. Wow. Anywho, I just thought that was a funny memory, a, a funny moment, and then a funny couple of dreams. And so, uh, any of you dream analyzers out there? Yeah. That's the whole thing about it. Uh, any of you dream analyzers, if you could maybe analyze those dreams, especially the second one. The first dream may have been, been a dumb dream. Oh, no. I me, want that first one analyzed. Somebody right, tell me what it means to put deodorant right. in your mouth. So, me helping... Me... And Kim, me trying to help Kim guide her into video creating ideas, walking in on Brie and Laramie, both with a stick of deodorant in their mouth, trying to put it under their arms. What does that dream mean? Yeah. I can't no wait to hear that part. Number two, a family of, there was probably 20 people gathered around a, a, a large dining table and kitchen island and every one of them had a video camera out <laughs> and they were all videoing each other as they served themselves dinner as they were eating dinner can you imagine though like your dad and then like just trying to talk over each other you no they were even. because they were because they were all talking and videoing it wasn't a silent video they were all just talking and, and doing and making a video because you and i can't make a video in the same space no so uh you guys have a great day and happy whatever day it is that you guys are going to see this it's saturday for us so all right i got no idea what this is but <laughs> i guess the things you'll do for your father huh How you, I can't, how do you do this? You can't do this.